single row knotless rotator cuff repair featuring the footprint ultra PK suture anchor with ultra tape suture and the true pass suture passer. In this Smith and Nephew rotator cuff repair technique animation, the knotless repair of a small tear in the supraspinatus tendon will be demonstrated. This repair will utilize ultra tape suture, a flat, uniformly woven suture tape designed to increase tendon to bone contact. The footprint ultra PK suture anchor with interlocking screw technology and the true pass suture passer, which simultaneously passes and retrieves suture or ultra tape in one step. This technique is achieved by using an anterior portal, a lateral portal, and a posterior portal. Visualization during the repair steps is accomplished through the posterior viewing portal. In preparation, a bursectomy is performed, assessing the mobility and nature of the tear. The first step is to pass an ultra tape suture through the tendon to create an inverted mattress stitch. Outside of the joint, load one limb of ultra tape suture into the lower jaw of the true pass suture passer. Close the jaws and pass it down the lateral cannula. Position the jaws of the true pass suture passer on the more anterior portion of the tendon to be repaired. Actuate the device by squeezing and releasing the rear handle to pass and retrieve the ultra tape suture in one motion. The ultra tape suture will remain held in the self capture door on the upper jaw of the instrument. Close the jaws of the true pass suture passer and withdraw it back out of the lateral cannula. The ultra tape suture is easily unloaded from the true pass suture passer by pulling it out of the small window on the right hand side of the upper jaw of the instrument. Adjust the lengths of the ultra tape suture limbs and using a suture loop grasper move the past limb of suture to the anterior cannula and out of the way. Repeat the first passing step, now passing the second limb of ultra tape suture through the more posterior portion of the tendon to be repaired. Using a suture loop grasper through the lateral portal, retrieve the limb of ultra tape suture exiting out of the anterior cannula and bring it back out through the lateral portal. An inverted mattress stitch has now been created. Outside of the shoulder, load both limbs of ultra tape suture into the footprint ultra PK suture anchor eyelet by first feeding them through the released threader loop and then by pulling on the threader tab. Clamp a hemostat over the loaded ultra tape suture to hold in place while a pilot hole is created. Introduce the gold tapered awl into the lateral cannula and create a pilot hole at the anterior lateral aspect of the greater tuberosity, tapping to ensure the black laser line on the awl is flush with the surface of the bone. Remove the awl. Remove the hemostat. Taking up a small amount of slack from the ultra tape suture limbs, Introduce the footprint ultra PK suture anchor into the lateral cannula, taking care not to twist the sutures. Position the anchor over the prepared pilot hole, aligning the eyelet so that it faces the tendon where the suture limbs enter the anchor. Using a mallet, tap the footprint ultra PK suture anchor into the pilot hole, ensuring that the black laser line is flush with the bone. Release the green stay suture from the inserter cleats, Slide them out of the footprint ultra PK suture anchor and discard. Maintain light downward pressure on the anchor inserter while individually tensioning the limbs of ultra tape suture through the footprint ultra PK suture anchor until desired repair tension is achieved. While keeping light downward pressure on the inserter, rotate the inserter knob clockwise to deploy the interlocking screw. Rotate until a loud click can be heard. Then rotate the inserter knob one quarter turn counterclockwise. This allows for easier separation of the anchor from the inserter. Remove the inserter and using the Smith & Nephew flush suture cutter, trim the excess limbs of ultra tape suture flush to the footprint ultra PK suture anchor. The repair is now complete.